it up, guys. Juliet. 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 It is, what, 4 a.m.? 5 a.m.? 5 a.m. at the airport. It just took like one hour to check in. Because this is this new Ryanair bag thing. But we are on our way to... Milano. Milano. We're going to Milan first. First stop. For the day. And we, our gate isn't open yet, so... We're just walking. Get something to eat, right? We're dead. We'll describe to you our process later on. Oh, well, we cheated the bag system. No offense, right there, but your bag system sucks. Oh, no. Useless. Uh, right. I think we're setting up flight for the flight. Oh, yeah. The flights aren't that bad. Oh, They're cheap. Yeah, no, the but the bag system sucks. Oh, yeah. So they moved. They improved it. Apparently, improved it like three months ago, and it makes everything so much slower now. Let's get something to eat, man. Alright, bye guys. We're done with breakfast. Manus is doing his assignments at the airport because because he's Manus and there's shit load of work to do. And he has a load of work to do that he didn't want to do before when I told him to do it. I've been trying to do it, but Ricky was getting one, t one, if you see on my old vlog, there was a fire alarm that went off when I was going to okay, India? Was it India? America? Yeah, so if you see one of my old vlogs, oh, no, 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 no. fire alarm. No, here! So we're on the way to our gate. The flight to Milan is like two and a half hours, and then we're gonna hang around there and then go to Venice. My arm's getting tired. How do people vlog like... That's your turn. <laughs> How do people vlog like so much? But we're also carrying a load of stuff because we tried to cheat the baggage system. We did. So what happened was we got given two 10 euro bags. 10 kg bags, what am I even saying? 10 euro bags. So my bag was 13 kilos, so I put it on the bag scale. Great. Take us together, obviously. Uh, so we were given 20 kilos as the two of us. So I got 13 kg on my bag scale, got my bag and then came off and Manus only had 7 kilos left so we had to take everything out, bring it down to 7, put everything back in. I feel like we're still carrying a load of stuff. And then it wouldn't go in the baggage carousel so we had to bring it to the, what was it? The desk and the lady just took it so that's what you do for Ryanair, you know, bags don't work so. Good day. Might not work everywhere. Work for us. It does not work every time, so if you go, well, go to the airport... It might work every time, you just never know. What does that try again next time? I'm gonna go to the airport, say that these people <laughs> made me do it, and then... I, I didn't make gonna, anyone do anything. They're gonna oh sue you. Oh my lord, look at the amount of people, Manus. That's a big queue. Alright, we're, we're boarding. We are on a bus. I love you, Milan. To Milan Central. It takes an hour. The flight was good, there was the office, but I didn't vlog it because I didn't have my camera. You're just lazy, that's why you're a exit. bad vlogger, that's why. I'm not, I legit was sitting at the emergency exit, I didn't have a bag. What was your flight? My flight was very similar to yours because we were on the same flight. Yeah, but you were sitting at the front and I was in the back. We both had... We both had... Uh, Extra day space, that's good. Were you sitting in row number one? How they let, yeah, how they let this dude on the bus without a seat is fair. Oh. How could it? How could they let someone on the bus without a seat? Oreo Center. We the uh, first person that we saw after coming out was Dan Crazy Palmieri. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. It's crazy. crazy. It's crazy. crazy. <laughs> what did you do in that video? I <laughs> 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 literally see it in my head about Sankari Palmer doing that thing. Espresso. It's espresso. It's not cappuccino, it's espresso. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to the land. Oh, the ball don't fall asleep. Let's see our, uh, let's see our tickets. Let's see, that. let's see where we're going in Milan. We have arrived in Milan Central Station. We're trying to find a way to the metro. Bonus, we gotta go faster, we don't have time here. Look at that beautifully built station. 
very nice. Milan is known for its architecture. Italy itself is really not known for its architecture. This is a costume, it's a good one. Huh? I don't even know what side to look for. Because the car's coming from right and left. I just can't get over how they're driving on the wrong side of the road, even though I can't even tell. Guess what, you guys? The Chindians are lost again. Like, do you think with all the traveling that we do, we'd be able to find our, pay, our way around? But no, we're still bad at Google Maps. Dad said, don't go to. Ooh, bicycles. We should rent one of these. Dad says, don't go to a Christmas market. Dad says, don't go to a Christmas market. Dad, I'm sorry, but it happened. <laughs> oh, that's our tram. Well, we can't see it right now. So right this up. is the Christmas market. Oh, right there, you can see the tram. Tiny little thing. How do we get like tickets and stuff? We're finally on the metro. metro after Remind you of Delhi? Yeah. It is kind of like Delhi. Except... Except what? <laughs> well, India has a lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> You're really gonna be my actor. Whoa! Look at how well built this thing is. Oh my! That's day. mad. I am impressed. Jeez! Look at this thing. It's the Duomo. Well, we go back now. <laughs> the Chindians finally got here after like 40 minutes. Look at that giant Christmas tree as well. Guys, that is a pretty cool building. So we're gonna go for a stroll in this beautiful place. Mars loves it, of course. I love Milan. Getting a pretzel. Getting a pretzel. Never been so good. <laughs> So we literally just had the best pretzel ever. The best pretzel ever. <laughs> Oof. So we should have shown it on the vlog. So good. But we were eat eating it too fast. And it was really good. So solid nine out of ten. Why? Why, was, why is there not a ten? A bit warmer would have been nice. Just leaving scope for something. Still nice. walking around the Duomo, which I'm so impressed by. Yeah. Manus was like, "Is it a church?" Before we got here. Which it is, but like, it's, it's a ridiculous Italian. church. <laughs> no, that's the Italian flag. At the top. Where? This. Italian flag looks like Ireland, except it's red instead of orange. It's literally orange. It's red. Or dark orange, I don't know. Anyway, we better go back soon. Go for a little quick stroll again. I love Milan, let's come back again. Yeah. We are walking into this thing, whatever this is. Love traveling. Traveling is the best. I love it. it gives me so much satisfaction. Come on, everyone visit Milan. Tell the Chilean. Are you a fan? Yeah. Ice cream! I'm a fan. <laughs> so just doing a bit of friendly shopping. A Louis Vuitton and Prada. A Manus's head. Prada. Barely friendly. And Prada. Why do they have so many Pradas? And Versace. We're doing a bit of friendly shopping from all our views. <laughs> this place is the Galleria, right? Uh, it's so good. And there's a Giorgi, Giorgio Armani, which I can't even pronounce. I shouldn't have brought Manus in here because he, I should have brought Manus in here. You know why? Manus is not motivated by anything in life. Except things like this. Except things like these. There's Gucci. There's a Luisa Fragoli, Fragnoli, Sragnoli, I don't know. I'm not good at these branded things. Here's Manus looking fly. So guys, what do you think of Milan? 
very expensive and very beautiful. Proper expensive. Proper expensive. All right, let's go find a castle or something else to look at. I like how the good the Milanos, the Milanese, Milan, people from Milan are at building things. <laughs> I'm impressed by their architecture. There's a lot of architecture, you know? This is the Sav Castello Sav I don't even know how to pronounce it. Castello Svor Svorzecco or something like that. I wish I was a princess. I wish I was Italian. <laughs> You could blend in well here though, you look like you are. Italians are so good looking. So is Mambay. Look at this beautiful castle. I love architecture in Italy especially. I think Italy in particular is known for it though. Like the, Le the Leaning Tower of Pisa, the Colosseum. I thought Italy was only known for the Duomo. Food. And food. To be fair, everyone has their perceptions of places and then they come visit them and they're like, Whoa, this place is awesome. Look at that little munchkin in a giant seat. Looks like one. He can't even Did you get that on camera? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. Blooper. <laughs> this costume's bigger than he is. Like, I like how the amount of detail they put into these things is crazy. Like it's so exact. I don't know how somebody's brain would come up with like building the Duomo. <laughs> so this beautiful place. Okay. Okay. We are getting on a train to Venice. We're very stressed. Honest has assignment due in two hours. This is Milan Central Station. He really has it all. Pasta, pizza, wine. The most good looking people in the world. Venice. Well. Absolutely stunning. And there is. Grace. That's her. Hunching her back. To the apartment. We are in the city of Venice, Venicia. Now we have to figure out how to get to things. Look, there's water boats. Yeah. Cool. City of love. Ah. So much carting around these days in the Chindians. Ah. <laughs> All right, we got to find a water boat that we can get on to get to our Airbnb. Not bad though. I like Venice. Here. Me too. I love a bit of Venice. A city entirely on water. Interesting, isn't it? It's too. It's quite small, so we can just walk around. Oh, we can go up there, yeah. Tomorrow? Tomorrow we are on the board by the Are you going in the direction? Uh, it's okay, we'll come tomorrow. Most likely we will anyway. Or we can go see anyway. This is a famous bridge. I think this is St. Mark's Bridge. But you can check. You're really gonna bring that all the way up there. Yeah. Alright. Let's go have a look then. At the city of Venice. Wow. I'm impressed. What do you think, Manus? Two beautiful cities in one day. Incredible. Manus is getting his daily gym in. Gymming in. Wow, look at that, beautiful, I'm going the other side, these water boats go all the way throughout Venice, this is gorgeous, 
So we reached our hotel. Well, we booked a room on Booking.com and they cancelled it. When we reached there, like they told us that, oh, we need to relocate you. So Booking.com, we hate you. Booking.com, we hate you. And we're telling our Indians never to book with you, ever. Anyway, they moved us into this room, which we had to pay like extra money for, which they better refund us, otherwise I'm suing them. This is a nice room, very old fashioned, like most Venice rooms are. Yeah, not bad. Show them the washroom. There's two people that don't get just likes the bathroom because he has the pot. Potty. Indian butt washer. Indian yeah, butt washer. So now we're gonna get the best. How come I can turn off the light from the toilet? Tom, the lights here are so messed up. Okay, so we're gonna go get the best pasta in the world, uh, which has 4,000 Google reviews. So how can you not? And a six euro bowl. So come on, Manas. I'm starving. Let's go. Move your ass. Okay. What shoes are you wearing? He's tired too. We're all tired. <laughs> Manas' project got done. Everybody, say your prayers. Thank God. Lucky dice came through. I can't even find it. <laughs> My zipper's down as well. All right, bye. We'll show you Venice later. We're here having the best pasta in the world, apparently. I don't know what it is, but it looks delicious. Look at that. I got the carbonara, Manus got the Alfredo with mozzarella. See how it is? Guess what, guys? We are eating again. <gasps> Cannolis. We really do have to try. Oh, fam, there's one right next door. <laughs> oh, <wow>. <laughs> <laughs> Any good? We <laughs> all. Brain freeze? Let me try. Nice. I think we skipped it too. Mmm. What do you think? You guys have a bite? <laughs> don't, don't be done that. Mm. You're gonna get unsubscribers. It's so creamy. It is really creamy. We're lost. Mm, we're lost again, you guys. Fine. For like the 90th time today. So this is St. Mark's Square. It's beautiful. Probably be nicer in the day though. Well, this side would. Whoa, look at the design on that, Manus. The paintings. The roof. Oh, no, thank you. No, thank you. I don't like how people keep offering me birds. I don't like birds. They have, carry a lot of diseases. <laughs> I like my boat. Don't say that so loud. We're on camera. I don't know what this is meant to be. Oh, there's shops and stuff here. That's why. There's shops and stuff. I guess they'd be open like during the day. Yeah, probably be really busy in the day. With these vlogs. What? This is a pretty big bridge. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the view? Nice. Good view, eh? Yo, you guys, we got like super cold and then came back to the apartment at like 9 or like 8.30 and we're dying because we got up at like 6 or we got up at like 4 and so we're really tired. We're gonna go to sleep. Tomorrow, I think we're gonna go do a really early tour of what is it? Murano, Burano, and Torcello. Murano, Burano, and Torcello. Yeah, I think that's it. Um, yeah, so it starts at like 9.30, so we're gonna go to bed and then get up early, have breakfast, etc. Manus is brushing his teeth in the bathroom. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed our day in Milan and Venice. Sorry we didn't vlog too much in Venice, I guess. We'll see you more tomorrow though. So thanks you guys for all your love and support. And uh, hope you keep enjoying our Euro trip, our Europe trip. And uh, comment down below if you have any suggestions or questions or anything. Bye. Love you guys. Bye.